Heavy rainfall in our area over the last few days is creating major issues for residents. Franklin County alone receiving almost 10 inches of rain. As News 13's Madeline Beerster shows us, they're working hard to handle the flooding problems there. There is still some pretty heavy flooding lingering here on Commerce Street in downtown Apalachicola. Just one of the roads that was closed Sunday evening after the county received nearly 10 inches of rainfall. Franklin County Sheriff AJ Smith says as multiple roads were closed overnight due to flooding issues, he warns residents to wait until it's safe to pass through those high flood areas. And then water stands on the road and you could lose control of your vehicle. You could run off the road, you could hit a tree, run into a ditch. So uh, the best thing when it's raining really, really hard, if you don't have to go somewhere, wait until the rain quits. And if you do see standing water, don't drive through it because you don't know what's in there. Local resident Donnie Mathis lives on Peachtree Street and says his yard is constantly flooding. Well, every time we get a big rain, it floods because the ditches will not run. It's, it backs up into my yard. It runs all the way around the back of my house. With his driveway constantly underwater, the excess rainwater runs off into his neighbor's yard. He says all of this is caused by ditches not running properly. Every time it happens, I call my county commissioners and they say, well, it's been doing this for 20 years. Well, after 20 years, somebody should have an idea how to fix something. Mathis says he will continue to reach out to county leaders in hopes of getting an engineer to their street to solve this water runoff issue. Pop-up showers and thunderstorms are expected to last throughout the rest of this week. In Franklin County, Madeline Beerster, News 13, Panhandle Strong.